short and sweet. <laughs> Today we'll visualize the monkeypox. You don't have this probably, so we need to load it into Maya. It's a plugin. It's, it's free in its basic version and we only need the basic version today. This is the website. The company is called Clarify and you have a Maya tool which is called mMaya and you log in to download and then you're downloading it, installing it and it lands in Maya. There are other modules here which you need to purchase. Uh, if you're interested in biology and biochemistry, please do this. I studied physics, so I don't know anything about it. And I'm, I don't know anything about what I'm going to visualize today. Here you find download and uh, you can enter a PDB ID. So here we are visiting PDB, the Protein Data Bank, and we type in monkeypox. And the first result is 4QWO. It's the uh, whatever small angstrom crystal structure of the profilin like protein from monkeypox virus in Zaire, found in, I guess, 2014. Let's just copy this string of four characters. We paste it. And I tick on import post download, and we're done. The protein lands in the scene and it looks like this. You have uh, lots of possibilities to change here. The chain A and the chain B can be uh, treated separately. You can visualize the atomic structure, that's what we currently see, or untick it. You have the Waltz scale, we can make the molecules much smaller, and other things like the surface resolution the mesh visibility the backbone backbone visibility is this this one and i'll show you two renderings and that's basically all i can do at this point have a nice day Show.